Greetings, friends. How are you, good one? This is Mr. Rani. We're going to continue with lesson, guys, 8.5. Okay, hold on. Is it 8 or 9? Yes, 8.5. Okay, use models to add. We already check how to add in the previous um, lesson. We already know how to add tens together or add ones together. That's it. Okay, so we're going to continue with page 335. Page 335, get a word for you, the page. Page, sorry. Page 335. So guys, questions, uh, five until 14, it is a homework. You should do it while you're on. Gonna do for you um, question number 15 and 16 at your book. Make sum of 45, we're gonna make sum, which two numbers, if we add them together, will give me 45. Draw a quick picture, write the numbers to this, add, First of all, add ones. So we're going to add ones to a two digit number. Okay, so it will give me the answer, or sorry, the sum is 45. So gonna gonna do the sum 45. It is one, two, three, four, four, and five ones. One, two, three, four, four five ones okay so we're gonna add ones one so go to ones and figure out which two numbers if i add them to together will give me five which two numbers any two numbers you want so i'm gonna choose three and two so I'm gonna choose three and two to give me five so because they told me to add ones only then I'm gonna choose which two two numbers if i add them together will give me five three and two so look what what should i do so we're gonna start 43 plus two is sorry equals 45. So I only add the ones. Only add ones. Three plus two equals five. And here's the, the tens and the four. You can draw guys like four tens. One, two, three, four. I'm gonna write the plus here. Okay. Three ones. One, two, three. And you raise it two. Will you give me 45 or 45? That's it. When they ask me to move the and to find to add by ones, I go and decide which two numbers I add them together will give me ones. Okay, add tens to a digit. Now tens, go to this digit and figure out which two numbers if I add them together will give me four. So maybe it is three and one, gonna take three and one, it's up to you guys. Okay, should I write here 43 plus two? 43, three, sorry. It's up to you, can do whatever you want. Maybe 41 plus uh, four, maybe 40 plus five, it's up to you, okay? I decide to, to try three and one. Okay, let, let's see. So we're gonna take three ten, and one, one. Okay, guys. And because of the tens, you could also, guys, add this. But I prefer to say, like, maybe this is five and this is zero because five plus zero. It's up to you. Or maybe this is zero and, and, and five. So I try to take zero and five. It's up to you. Only when they say to me, Add tens, then make the ones five and zero, three and zero, whatever plus zero. Okay, so I try this one. Okay, guys, sorry. Okay, we're gonna model it. So four, three, one, two, three, and one, four tens. And look at ones, it stays the same five, only five, one, two. Three, four, five. I make the ones the same because this is why I chose zero. This five plus zero, then the answer will be 45. You can see that it's 35 plus 10. It's up to you. You can change any number you want. I want to see some, uh, some, another views. Okay, guys. Okay, let's move to next page. We have a problem. We should do it together. 
Okay, it is some um, it's in the same order as your book. Okay, so I'm gonna follow the same order. There are seven ox words. Uh, okay, this this one question number seventeen at your book. This question. Okay, seven ox tree. Where is it? There it goes. And thirty two uh, pine. Okay, is this the same? Yes, trees in the park. How many trees are in the park? Sorry, I don't have the, uh, the same uh, as your book. Because this, uh, they asked me about how many all of them, it is plus. So you should add 32 plus 7. 32 plus 7. Okay, guys, you, you should draw. You only take how to draw. Okay, I have three tens. One, two, three. And how many ones? Two ones. One. So I have here seven ones, only seven ones. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Now I can add them together. Now I can add them together. 32 plus seven. Now we're going to add the ones together. Okay, can I change the color? Yep. Let's add the ones together, the circles together. Now I have seven and two. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I have nine and ones and how many in tens? Three in tens. So the answer is 39. 39. Okay. Hold on. Question number two at your book. It is um, the strawberries. Read the picks. Okay. 63 strawberries. Then she picks 30 more. How many strawberries does read the pick? Okay, more. More means a plus. Okay, two things together like the trees means plus. More means a plus. So we're gonna add 63 plus 30. Sorry, 63 plus 30. You guys, you should uh, draw to figure it out. Okay, I have six ones, uh, ten. Sorry, one, two, three, four, five, six, and three tens here. One, two, three. Okay, can you see? And I have three ones. One, two, three, and no one here. No one, sorry, here. So because there's no ones to add, like we take before, we should add the tens together. Add the tens together. Okay, here's the tens. We're going to add this tens with this tens. Okay? Yep, six, seven, eight, nine. I have nine tens, nine tens, and only three ones. So 93, 93. Okay, Kenny planted two rows of heads the same, uh, of corn. He used 20 seeds, yes, in each row. He has 18 seeds left. How many seeds of corn did Kenny uh, have, okay? So can you plant the two rows? This is the two rows. Can I draw for you? This is row number one. And this is row number two. This is what's the meaning of two rows. Row number one and two. row number two. Okay? He used 20 seeds in each row. So I have in each row 20 seeds. I have 20. One, two, three, four, until 20 in each seed. In, the, in the, each row, sorry, 20 seeds. In the first row, this 20. In the second row, it is 20, okay? He has 18 seeds left. In each row, uh, he has 18 se um, seeds left, okay? When he put the seeds in each row, now he has 18 left. 18 left, okay? You should say that is 18 left and double bit, okay? The, uh, how many seeds of corn did Kenny have? How many seeds of corn did can you have at the first, guys? At the first. So to know how many, we should add all of them together. So he planted 20 and 20 and 18 left. We should add them together, all of them, to find uh, how many seeds, okay? We should draw for each one, okay? For 20, I have only two. For the first 20, two tens. For the second 20, can I gonna choose another color? I have only two without tens. And for 18, another color, I have one, 10, and eight ones. One, two, three, four, five, 
six, seven, eight. Now we're gonna add all of them together because there is no ones to add. We're gonna add the tens. What's the meaning of tens that we're gonna add it? Add them together. This ten, this ten, and this ten. Okay, can you add them together? Yeah, count with me. Yep. Yeah. One, two, three, four, five. I have five in tens. Five. Just count them together. Okay, and how many ones left? Okay, I know it is a hard question, but you can do it, guys. Okay, so you have a question, also question 20, that is a test of proof. What is the sum of 37 plus 20? You should know it while you're on. We're done for today. Thank you, guys. See you next week. Bye-bye.